Hello everyone, my name is Abhishek and welcome back to my channel. So today I have one of our subscribers, Srikant with me and he's here to share his job interview experience. So recently Srikant uh, got placed in one of the companies is going to share us the information. But what's more important for us to learn is about his interview experience, are there jobs at this point of time? How did he get this opportunity? Because a lot of you have these questions and I have requested Srikant uh, for his time and if he can come onto the channel and share his experience and uh, thankfully uh, Srikant is here. So Srikant, why don't you just introduce yourself so that I can start the conversation. Yes, uh, my name is Srikant. Uh, uh... I have uh, four years of experience into IT uh, industry, and uh, I have uh, one end of year of one end of years of experience in as an annual test engineer. Awesome. Um, after that, uh, I was into build and release department. Uh, now I am working as a DevOps engineer. Uh, this is the small introduction about me. Abhi. Okay, so this is very, very important information because many of our subscribers are transitioning from build and release system administration, even yes. from non-IT background to IT yeah. background. So I'm very sure your experience, your journey, and even the way you have applied for these companies and how did you get selected, this is going to help a lot of people. So yes. let's start with a, a quite obvious question. So you have four years of experience yes. and people keep asking, right, Abhishek, at this point of time, there are no calls. How should I apply for it? What should I do? So what is your take on this? Uh, basically, what my take is uh, uh, compared to uh, last few months, last few months, uh, uh, there are uh, quite less calls. Okay. But uh, the thing is, what I suggest is... Uh, to the people who are uh, trying to get you get the job uh, right now just focus on the preparation and okay. uh, uh, and uh, you should be active on the social platforms like linkedin uh, and okay. nokri uh, and uh, i want you to update the uh, resume properly okay. uh, you will get a chance uh, for sure uh, that's how that's how i uh, got the opportunity uh, actually i posted a, a uh open to work uh in linkedin okay. uh okay. after th after that uh, i got a message from somebody uh whom i don't know and uh, uh he he shared me uh the details interview details uh, uh oh, and awesome. uh, i have attended and, and uh, i cracked it actually awesome 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 this so, is how uh, it goes so uh did you apply for any other companies or this is the first one uh like no, how many I, I have applied uh, quite a lot, uh, Abhi, uh, yeah. actually. Uh, to be honest, uh, I have applied uh, quite a lot uh, of interviews and uh, some are scheduled, some are not scheduled. Uh, yeah. So, so I have applied a lot. Yeah. So basically what you're saying is you have applied for a lot of companies. Yes. You only got few job calls and out of which the one that you got is actually unexpected. Yes, you unexpected. From yes. someone, right? Yes, yes. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, one thing that I keep saying is you should not lose hope. Yes, when the that, situations that, are tough, you have to play even more. Right? Yes, that's the only thing I suggest that uh, uh, anything come from uh, anywhere. Uh, so you should not lose hope and uh, you should so, be prepared uh, for everything actually. So that's the so, only suggestion I can give. So what was the position actually, uh, re re what is the requirement uh, for the position? Like, in this interview, the one that you got selected, yeah. what was the uh, job description kind of? Like yeah. you don't have to share the exact one, but yeah, sure. at least like on an overall basis, how was the job description looking like? Yeah, yeah I can I share. Uh, actually, uh, I have applied uh, for a senior DevOps engineer. Okay. So uh, I think, I mean, uh, my interview experience was a very strange thing uh, for this okay. particular interview. Okay. I can I can share you like, uh, uh, for the after the screening uh, uh, next day I, I I got I mean uh, I have a technical interview uh, for the okay. first one where I have been asked the basics like okay. uh, Linux git uh, maven and uh, all the tools uh, which are required so I have been asked and uh, uh, and the second day uh, uh, I have been given a task oh okay for the second round of interview I have been given a task. The task is to set up a CSED end-to-end okay. -end from Git to Kong. Oh, awesome. 
this this is thing i have been given and i i i was given only one day <laughs> okay so, yeah uh, i have prepared a cicd uh, a complete cicd uh, set up in my local and i have showed it the demo uh, then nice. uh, i have been selected this this is how it goes actually oh this is very nice like yeah. so when they asked to uh, set up cicd pipeline CICD. Right? yes so, yes did you during that uh, demo yes. also uh, they have asked uh, some questions like what are what are their requirement what are their uh, expectations nice. for me so they have few requirements uh, which i can satisfy that's uh, mm. i can uh, i am confident about that uh, that's what i conveyed them and uh, uh, they have selected and i am lucky enough actually uh, so, so this cicd pipeline um, yeah. was this like you know they have given you this has to be the structure of the cicd pipeline like yeah. did they tell you that these are the stages that have to be there okay okay so so what they suggested me is to uh, they i mean uh, they they are they have assisted me like uh, i mean uh, how how good enough you are uh, into cicd that's what the requirement is uh, basically okay. uh, they want me to set up a, uh, a complete process actually uh, nice, nice. so they have uh, suggested me some tools like uh, yeah just maven uh, tomcat and nexus repository even i have included sonar cube also in the ci cd and i have showed them oh so nice. these are the four tools i have uh, set it up and i uh, have showed you showed them the demo so when they asked you about ci cd did they ask you like you have to do it through jenkins only github actions only yes. gitlab okay what was they, the requirement they they asked me to do in uh, jenkins yeah uh, yeah i see that common pattern yeah. that most yeah. of the interviewers are basically asking about jenkins all have you also seen that uh, many people asking about jenkins yes of course of course uh, jenkins is the thing uh, that uh, you should uh, i mean uh, it it is a weightage for your resume actually okay jenkins okay. is the must and uh, should thing like uh, if you know jenkins uh, and uh, whatever the requirement is you can do it actually that's the, the cicd part you will uh, you can be perfect like in any yes, of the cicd tools specifically yes. if that is jenkins you will get more opportunities yes yes uh, yes many people are actually using jenkins right? yes 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 awesome so it was just two rounds uh, one is in yeah. the first round they ask you next git shell script did they also ask you about scripting Yes, uh, they asked me about the scripting. Thanks to you, you made a video on uh, shell scripting. Uh, awesome. Actually, I followed that. Uh, I think uh, four to five videos are there for the shell yeah, scripting yes. thing. Um, uh, I am lucky enough that uh, I got a question from that uh, scripting part. Uh, oh. uh, uh, Sixteen to nineteen questions, if I am not wrong. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I I got a question from there. Oh, <laughs> I am lucky enough nice. to. Uh, my suggestion is to follow that actually <laughs> yeah, yeah the shell scripting tutorial shell scripting, actually yeah shell scripting yeah. linux basics git uh, yes uh, one cloud platform like um, I, i am into aws actually so uh, AWS, one okay. cloud platform kubernetes docker hmm. so the, these are the things uh, uh, abhi very nice so the job description was more or less the common ones right yes uh, it's common common uh, i think this job description uh, in devops is like one of the standard ones where standard, yes. you about linux git shell scripting then some people have seen uh, most of the job descriptions i've seen terraform yes. then kubernetes of course of course uh, kubernetes. applications or jenkins as your ci cd orchestration yes, right? yes, yes this is something okay <laughs> awesome so, i i am lucky enough that uh, the standard uh, job description i got it actually <laughs> yeah <laughs> and when you uh, try to because you were applying for uh, some uh, job requirements right uh, you must have gone through linkedin you must have done some research yes. so yes. what did you if if i ask you what are some like if you want to tell our subscribers some top yes. five tools uh, which they have to learn so that yes. they can apply for maximum number of jobs yeah can you can you suggest some five of course uh, my suggestion is for uh, even for the freshers or for the experienced or for the non native background candidates you should be strong enough in linux uh, the okay. linux basics should uh, must and should be there okay. and uh, you should know the version control system this 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 is a second yeah. one and uh, you should know one ci tool like uh, jenkins uh, yeah. this is the third one and uh, you should know the kubernetes uh, okay. this is the fourth one and uh, fifth one is docker 
Docker. Okay. So these are the five tools I can suggest. If you are strong enough in these tools, uh, uh, all the tools are, I think, uh, they are easy, actually, if I'm not wrong. Actually. Yeah. Okay. So now I'm going to ask you one important question. And I think many people who are watching this, they will also expect me to ask you this question. So how did you transition from build and release to DevOps? Okay. Yeah. So how did you prepare for it? And if someone who is watching this video and they want to transition from build and release to uh, DevOps, can you share some, uh, you know, guidance or whatever you have done because you have already succeeded in it. So yes. can you share some standard roadmap? Yeah. Uh, during the initial days, uh, I was into manual testing completely. Uh, I, I don't know about, uh, about the deployment process and uh, everything. Okay. I don't know anything about that. Okay. So, uh, uh, I am into manual testing and I was, I was planning to uh, learn Selenium, uh, mm -hmm. to move to, uh, automation. Yeah. And, uh, even I was planning for API testing, uh, and, uh, E2E end-to-end -end testing. I was, even, I was in that, uh, uh, mindset, uh, okay. move for uh, automation and, uh, so, so that I can, uh, get the opportunities, uh, yeah. more yeah. or less, uh, rather than uh, into manual testing. Yeah. So I am lucky that uh, my manager uh, uh, suggested me to move to the build and release department. Okay. Uh, it, I think it was uh, easy for me because I was into team. Uh, I, I, I worked in a team uh, and uh, I was a junior resource at that time hmm. uh, where the CICD was uh, set up already. And uh, you, you should be... Uh, uh, prepared enough for the deployments actually for the yes. release part only i was uh, active uh, at that time uh, and uh, uh, with the senior resources with the help of senior resources uh, i learned from uh, them actually uh, how how they uh, okay. uh, develop the groovy script uh, how the application architecture is uh, the, at that time i learned all the all those things mm -hmm. and uh, after that, uh, slowly I uh, I learned all the tools, uh, starting from Linux, starting from Git, uh, Mav, and so. so how that, did you learn? How did you learn these things? Any videos? Any materials? How did you? Yes, learn yes, yes. Uh, before uh, uh, one year, uh, mm -hmm. I I was into. I mean, I I am active on uh, LinkedIn actually. There are uh, a okay. lot of people post uh, uh, those uh, videos, end-to-end -end videos. Yes. Yes. I followed a lot of videos actually. Uh, and mm -hmm. I was, I mean, I was active on Medium also. Okay. Uh, you guys post uh, all the things actually. Um, and uh, thanks to you, actually, I I am not forgetting that. Thanks to no, you. No, no, no. Such a fantastic yeah. uh, a playlist. Even I suggested my friends also. Okay. Uh, that playlist yeah. actually. Uh, if you're, uh, what my suggestion is, if, if your basics are good, uh, if yes. you learn, uh, if you check your, uh, if somebody checks your uh, playlist, uh, they will easily get the job. That's what the, that's the suggestion uh, I can give. Yeah, but in general, because you started a year back, right? And yeah. that time my channel was, I think my channel just back to yeah. eight months back. Yeah. So you must have followed something else at that point of time. Right? Yes, yes. So uh, I what, what are those things so that the subscriber will also understand? Yeah. yeah, I forgot to tell you one more thing. Like, uh, I was uh, laid off uh, last year. Oh, oh. so <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I was laid off last year. Uh, since then, uh, I I am uh, I'm not I'm doing a job anywhere actually. Oh, okay. I think uh, I started your videos in January. Uh, yeah. So. Uh, that's the thing I forgot to tell you actually. Oh, <laughs> the past that's, months, that's I was not uh, working anywhere actually. Firing, actually. Yeah. yeah. Even more inspiring. That, you know, from at this hard time, from layoff to you yes. are DevOps yes. engineering role in this tough time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> great, <Yeah>. great. <laughs> so from great. past six months, I was uh, working on something like uh, I did some freelancing, freelancing also. Okay. And, uh, uh, I was uh, checking your uh, YouTube uh, videos and uh, I have practiced lots of projects in GitHub actually. So that's the yeah. only thing uh, which motivated me uh, to do something actually. 
Yeah, and I think you said one more very important thing. If you get layoff or laid off at yeah. this point of time, there is also freelancing opportunities. Right? Yes, of course. Not yes. get demotivated. Yeah, many people get demotivated. Oh no, I got laid off. Market is down. Yeah. How do I proceed? So again, you said very important thing, right? You can do freelancing also if you have knowledge. Yeah. If you <laughs> okay. have knowledge, you can so, do freelancing, and, and uh, yeah. uh, that motivates you more. Uh, uh, yes. Then uh, preparing, uh, uh, sitting idle at home. Uh, if you if you go for freelancing, uh, it motivates you like anything. Uh, I mean, yes. uh, this is my personal experience. Awesome. Yeah. So I'll ask you one final request uh, because I have asked you a lot of things and patiently you said uh, answers to all of the questions. So I just have one request. So once I upload this video, I am going to take a promise from you that. Anyone who has any questions, you are going to reply to each and every comment. Sure, uh, <laughs> that's my pleasure, Abhi. I am sure I will. Okay. I will answer. Yeah, uh, because you know people have a lot of questions. Unfortunately, many people don't have uh, the mentors. Many people don't have you know proper guidance. And from people like you who have already succeeded, right, in this tough times, from getting laid off to getting job yeah. from BRE, build and release to actually getting into DevOps position so i can give them some answers but if you give them the answers they'll feel more connected sure. and you know they can get the right answers from you yes 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 right okay so srikant has promised so whoever is watching this video if you have any questions put them in the comment section and srikant is going to answer the questions for us <laughs> okay okay srikant i think that's all i have uh, at this point of time and i'm sure that our subscribers audience We'll love to connect with you in the future again. But for now, thank you so much for joining and sharing your interview experience and all your preparation. Thank you so much. So, and thanks everyone. That's all I have for the video uh, for today. And uh, please put your questions in the comment section. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. Take care everyone. Bye. See you all in the next video.